we didn't have to come. I know, I know, we had this conversation already on the phone, but it still doesn't feel right for me to impose on you like this. Thank you for coming, though. Everything was getting to me a bit too much, and... <sighs> you can just sit over there, or anywhere else you like, really. I don't make it my business to tell people what to do. Would you like something to drink, though? Something to eat? You... Yes, I'm okay, I promise. I already told you earlier. I had already calmed down, so it wasn't necessary for you to come all the way here. I really do appreciate it, though. Your company is always welcome. Especially when I'm drowning in those problems. What matters is that right now I'm feeling okay again. I don't know why I was so distraught earlier. The suppressants? Now that you mention it, I think I did read up on some weird side effects. <sighs> I think I'd better lay off them for now. Maybe they'll have alternatives in the pharmacy. I'll go look in the morning. Wait, before you go sit on the couch, is it okay if I... just hold you for a bit? Your hand, I mean. I'm sorry that it's such a childish request, but... Uh, thank you. Your hand is still kind of cold. It must be freezing outside. Even with the heater in my apartment, I feel like I can see smoke coming out of your nostrils. <laughs> You're still worried, aren't you? I can see it in the way your eyebrows knit together. I told you I'm fine. I had a smoke and I'm good now. I don't know how to answer that. I want to believe that it's all gone now. The thoughts of the friends I lost still pop up out of nowhere. Then I worry about where you are and what you're doing, and then I start panicking. I'm grateful you were there when I had that crisis. Can we... kiss? <clears throat> you're so pretty. Every time I see you, I just feel so... <laughs> Sorry, I felt a bit nauseous there. Let me sit down for a bit. <sighs> Maybe I'm not as okay as I thought I was. <sighs> no, it's fine. Just let me breathe in silence for a sec. Shit. I'm starting to feel hot. Not a fever. It's... You should go. No, seriously. You should get out of here. I think I know what's happening. Go. Please, please don't make me ask again. 
You've never seen an alpha in a rut, have you? Trust me, it's really bad. Especially if there is someone else around. When I get into a rut, whoever is around me, whatever their secondary gender is, I will devour them. You don't want this. If I lay my hand on you, I won't be able to forgive myself, so just go. If you really want to help me, please just go. Come and knock on my door once every other day. Check that I'm still alive if you have to. That's more than I could ever ask of anyone. But don't stay here. Go, okay? <sighs> you did not just do that. You did not just push me down against the couch. This is not going to end well. Hmm. Don't look at me with such desperation. We can't hold back anymore. Oh, you are so done with. Oh, now you're trying to grab my arms and push them away? It's far too late for that. I told you to get out when you had a chance. Now you're gonna be all mine.